A storm is coming. Mankind faces ruin and despair. The world is changing, yet hope remains in the hearts of the people. We go about our daily lives never knowing the forces that can change our destinies forever. We are oblivious, ignorant like sheep to the slaughter. This night, in the year of our Lord 1047, marks the beginning of our journey together. A journey into darkness, into madness. I watch him from the shadows. Is he the one? He has come far already, but he will be tested, tested to the very limits of human endurance and beyond. This night he rides looking for the old gods, armed with an amulet that has led him here. Tonight he will begin his journey into oblivion. The struggle for supremacy is eternal, inevitable. Victory is the natural objective of every creature on this world. They will kill and die for their kind to dominate. Some call this eternal struggle equilibrium, the balance between light and darkness. These are dark times, times without hope. Men of faith claim that this is a test from God to strengthen our spirit. Perhaps this is true, or perhaps it is simply a pious lie. If it is true, darkness has come to engulf one's proud humanity, and we are witnessing the end of mankind.
Who are you? I am Gabriel. I have traveled here seeking the Guardian of the Lake. You are from the Order? They sent you? How do I find them? He... He will find you. In the forest. I follow him into the old forest, watching him from afar. He is strong indeed. The one God comes to drive out the many, but here, in this place, God's influence is thin and threadbare. The old gods still hold sway here. Few venture this far into the wood. He is disturbed by dreams, dreams that gnaw at his very soul. He will rest for the night, but rest will not come easy. The battle has left him weakened, but he knows the dream will return, and though he fears nothing on this earth, yet his nightmares sap the strength within him and leave a cold grip on his heart. Tomorrow he will use the old hunting path. Long has it been in disuse, but for now he dreams. <laughs> What motivates a man to confront the challenges that most of us would run from? Condemning him to solitude, exposing him to defeat and death. The answer is love, a force so powerful that all reason becomes blind to it, blind to all things, even the truth. Loss of love can make a man desperate, desperate enough to do anything to bury the truth, to hide from its pain.
can travel no further. You will find what you seek ahead. 